Hello guys, this is Zuma, and welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. So before we jump into the missions, guys, I just want to show you guys a really quick and easy way to get some money in the game. Uh, thank you to Merrick on my Discord for showing me this. Uh, so basically, all you do is buy sodas from the vending machine for $10, and break them down into components and then sell those components for profit. So these are, vending machines are all around the map, guys. It's absolutely insane how many they are. Um, so it's randomized how many these give you. But the most I've ever got is about 100 from one. Well, oh my God. Right, that was actually pretty good. What was that, about 31 it says there? All right, see, so, so I was buying these for $10. Now, if we go over here, I'm actually near one of the shops. This guy is about 12,000. So, let's have a look. If we break down the cans, you'll see there, top left. So we get six uh, uncommon, no, three uncommon and six common components. So the six common sell for 30, I think it's five each, and the three uncommon sell for eight each. So it's 54 in total. I paid 10 for the can, so 44 euro dollar profit. So as you can see here, um, yeah, I think I have about 700 cans. I might have gone a little bit overboard with this. So I believe if we break these down, so just look at my components at the top left there. What have I got? 1, 000, nearly 1,400, 656 six uncommon. Oh my God, right, let's do this. Let's break these down. So I believe in breaking these down, I also get crafting XP as well. That is, what the, oh, this, might be, this might be too much. <laughs> <laughs> I've only been doing this for like 10 minutes as well. I don't know if this is going to get patched. Is it a bug or a glitch? I don't know because it's you're just using the, uh, the app, you know, whatever's in the game. Limited edition. Oh, Jesus. Um, Yeah. 6,000 components. Oh, no. I'm not going to drop them. Can I break those ones down? Have I, have I reached the... Oh no, we're, we're still we're still going a little bit. All right, have I done the max? Yeah. Okay. So five thousand, close to five thousand components I got then. So as I said before, they sell for uh, five each. They sell for eight each. So let me just have a little look. Oh yeah. Of course I leveled from thirteen thirty seven crafting experience. Did you just see that? What are the chances? All right, hey buddy. We're gonna buy some new iron. Few dozen oh, pounds. level four crafting. Well, be my fucking guest. I was still gonna keep going then. All right, so just to make sure that the common ones do sell for five each, let's have a look. Yep, five each right there. So that's thirty thousand euro dollars. This guy has twelve thousand. So is it worth me selling? Yeah, and the uncommon sell for eight. So is it even worth me selling any of the un uncommon? I might as well just sell. What is that gonna be? If I sold 5,000, damn, yeah, 2,000, uh, 2,500, right, let me sell 2,000 of this, uh, sell, this, I still don't believe this is, all oh, right, that's easy, thank you for doing that, that's insane, uh, like, one less, 2,400, nearly there, there we go, 2,417 two, is going to give me all of his money. That's ins I still got 3,000. That is insane. So I spent 7,000 on on the uh, cans, right? If I, got, if I had about 700. Jesus. Right, I need to go to more vendors. Uh, thank you. We're back up. All right, so the mission that we have to do is automatic love. You can see on the right there. Yeah, so, and I think, guys, if you, if I save the game and load the game back up all these come back so and what's great that only give me one then what's great about them as well is these cans don't take up any space they don't have any carry weight so the best way to see this is just each can that pops out is basically 44 euro dollars for free as well as some nice crafting xp so where i need to go now is over to cherry blossom market is it yeah, so you can just keep running around this little area here. That's one of my cans that dropped out that I must have missed. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Where's the uh, little fast travel? Yes, yeah, so every vending machine I see now, I'm just going to do it as a, like a passing thing, you know? Just spend whatever I can. 
And I, I think the cans should have weight behind them. I think maybe just had a little bit of carrying weight, maybe to stop this. I don't know. So we're at a Kabuki market. I'm going down to Cherry Blossom Market. And there's actually even more vending machines here, I think. And there's a trader down here that has about 6,000 to sell as well. But yeah, welcome back, guys. For those watching on Zoom Upload, do leave a like rating. Man. Loving this game so far. we be able to sink a few hours in today, actually. Play about five hours. All right. So that's one of the uh, traders right there. And the vending machines is like one was here. Yeah, there we go. Let's see how many this gives me. <laughs> Jesus Christ. 60? All right. I, uh, I think it's worth clicking even if you don't see anything because I've noticed that the game doesn't pump them all out. There's actually some that's invisible. Look out. It's 36 that time. So you see I'm back to over 100. I'm back to over 100 cans already. And there's some over here as well. I think you can also buy cans from people. Uh, yeah, this machine. And that's the woman that I sell to right there. But what makes this overpowered is that these cans don't cost any carry weight. So I don't even have to sell them now. This is... What the hell, man? All right. I think I maybe have nearly 200 cans now. See? I'll, hey, no. th these are mine. And I think... I just want to see this. When what you buy I something, say? I think it resets. Is that how the reset mark? <laughs> he looks looking at me like I'm well shifty. <laughs> yes. This is a glitch in the matrix. Do not blame me. Five, just peruse. Right, that'll do. Right. Let me just see. Yes, this is the vendor. Um, let me just see how many I got then. So it's like a consumables. Uh, what should we go by? Is it the weight that maybe I can see everything around about the same weight? 71, right there. 7160, so what's that? That's 130, is it? I know I got some more. 130, that'll do. All right, let me break these down. Get some more crafting XP. Jesus. Oh, the components don't even take any weight. What? The components aren't going up. They don't take any weight either. That's... That is crazy. Right, so I'll have the 6,000 off you. Speed that up a little bit. And but on, this is a bit different on this one. Is it worth me buying some of the rare ones? Because I don't know how to get rare, obviously, I'm getting a lot of common and uncommon. So... Damn. Right, I might sell these then. I'll do. I will have all your 6,000. And this is amazing. And then if I go to what she has, see the stash. They seem really expensive though, but look at that, I'm at 21,000 and I've still got so much more components. So let's see if I wanted to buy that 7,000. So am I going to be able to get this back if I buy the rare components? Yeah, she then has the money. So I'm literally just swapping this, literally just swapping this back around, right? She has 15,000, and then, so I'm just swapping these out for rare components and rare upgrade components. So let me sell these back to you now. I've got to, should we just go to, uh, that'll do. There we go. Thank you from all back. So we've just done a, a really good trade. I gave her some cans, and she gave me some rare upgrade components and rare item components, and I've still got the 21,000 as well as a boatload of other components. I haven't touched my uncommon components yet. I still got 3,300 of them. 
So how much how much is that there then? What is that? Twenty four thousand right there. My God. <laughs> All right, let's just carry on. This is this is great. Oh man. Oh man. Yeah, so that's a good way to earn money. I see these little vending machines now. They're like, I don't know, little boxes of gold dust. Oh, yeah. It's... Forgot about this one. Hey, guys. So, Euro dollars, very easy to come by. And I don't know how long that's going to be live for or in the game for. So, you know, use it as much as you can, I guess. I know. It's... I don't know if it's cheating, is it a glitch? Is it just being smart using the game's mechanics? Uh, let me know what you think, I'd be really interested. All right, automatic love. Let's go. So how far away from that? It's literally just right around the corner. Oh yeah, we've got Jackie's bike now as well. We're going the right way here, huh? Oh, and my backpack, my inventory. Uh, I've actually got some better clothing, I think. That's 35. I thought I did. No, I must have sold it. Oh, that's the one. Level requirement 10. Uh, no. We got a little bit to go. Got a little bit to go. Oh man, that's the. There's a lot of these burrito ones around as well. Everyone just eats burritos here <laughs> and drinks soda. So it's it's on this level. It's just over there. The only bad thing is clicking it loads of times and having to pick them up. But think of every click that you do is forty-four dollars. Oh yeah, we, we've uh, we've seen this guy before. <laughs> not not off back there. If you saw the end of the last episode, <laughs> Jesus, oh, we're bonded for life. Are we going back up here? You have a perk to unlock. All right, so yeah, these perks, man. So I I was going for stealth, right? And I thought the um, let me have a look at this stealth one. So here, dagger dealer allows you to throw knives. Right. So do I need to... I thought that was just a, something I can do automatically. Do I need to buy the knives to throw them? Is that right? So we've got one, only one perk point. So we was going for a stealth character. Level 2 in stealth. But I need to start doing more stealth takedowns to upgrade my stealth. Right? Like that was just good. The assassin deal 50% more uh, to human enemies. Grants immunity to poison, so putting poison on my blade if we go down this route. Enemies affected by poison are slurred. There's a deal 20 something more damage to enemies affected by poison. I don't know, maybe getting poison throwing knives, would that count? <laughs> Increase headshot damage by 50%. Yeah, damn, that was so good. Increase health regen. So cold blood. If I've got this right, cold blood is activated when you do a takedown, right? Cold blood is activated, then you get all these cold blood perks with whatever you've got. Is that right? Increased body armor by 10% per stack of cold blood. So there's like levels to it as well. Which is why you haven't got that one. Yeah, I, I'm going to leave, leave it a little bit. I'll have a little think about which direction I want to go in. I want to get some missions under my belt. Um, I want to see... Oh, this weapon that I've got. The chemical... It's like a... Sets them on fire. But it's like a charging one. It's absolutely brutal. But... Anyway, go to uh, Mega Building H8. At what point do I... <laughs> it's like... Whoa, don't be dashing away from this. What I want is a hundred. Just give me a hundred straight away and then I'll be happy. I'm barely dipping into my money now. Cash money. Is there more? Don't, don't, please don't be more. Please don't be more. This is like, yeah, oh, thank God. <laughs> I'm addicted, man. 
Yeah. So that's on the. That's going to be there forever now, right? We've just unlocked it. But you ran a discount yesterday. That price. Oh, that game is more stressful than right. Take the elevator to clouds. Right. So what exactly is? Uh, we'll go to journal. If I can. There we go. Uh, automatic love. So you've decided to find the chick who put on the first class shit show. Uh, she had a job and you took it because there was no one else to knock some sense into your gonk head. I'm here now, but so what? This search and rescue bullshit's a dead end. But that's about to stop me. Maybe Evelyn will. Who knows? Sure seems like she doesn't want to be found. All right. Yeah, so we... People think I killed... Oh, what's Akas... What's, Ak what's he called again? Is it here? Is that his name? That was fucking Arasaka? <laughs> I think he owns the company, right? But it was really his son who did it. Here we go. The way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. All right, Keanu. Uh, take the elevator to clouds. What have I missed this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. The miners were able to survive without access to food and fresh water for two weeks. Judy seems nice. Why? Little something called intuition. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. Head to clouds in the evening. Oh, what? Oh, this is about right, isn't it? Seems like the evening. Do we have a time? Yeah. 9 p.m.? Was well, evening? Is that night? <laughs> Hello? So, if you get the right vendor, I think you can buy 60 cans straight away. Welcome to Cloud. Don't mind me, I've got a problem. Where we know what you're looking for. Would oh. you care to jack into the terminal? Uh, looking for our Evelyn looking Parker. Looking for an Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. Tempting. <laughs> I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Jack in, please. Huh. I'm sorry. Did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu. Let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef. Point blank. Oh, God. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer. Keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close. Fine. We'll play our own game. How could you possibly know what I'm looking for? Clouds always knows. Your deepest desire, we find it. You'll have your needs fulfilled, and maybe much more. Less is not a word we use around here. All right. All right jack into jack this. off. <laughs> this will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Uh, <laughs> Shout samurai. Afterlife, though. Afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Ooh. Ooh, who do I like the look of, guys? <laughs> Sky? Two matches. Interesting. Okay. Is that normal or. Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with 
Unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? Um, who is which? The but shit. Sky, I think. Rather go with Sky. <laughs> I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. Uh, oh well, money doesn't seem so trivial anymore. Jack out, don't want the hour. There you go. Easy money. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Do you have any more of these soda machines around? <laughs> Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. You won't find any Yeah, Keanu, go inside. eat a dick. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your stay. Oh, <laughs> I'm getting my money back for paying into this place. I'll be about it. Oh, but wait. That wasn't a lot, but that'll do. Why? Why? Is there so many soda cans and machines around here? It's like they want you to earn all the money. What's that? I don't, I don't know what that is. I think I might be able to sell that still. Oh, you can sell milkshakes as well. Yeah, he's like spitting a lot out. Guess that makes you a real deviant. A what? Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. <laughs> Not bad, but it would be much better. I can't get in. What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am. Oh, is this a good one? Is this a good one? You can ah. take it up with no, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? Does that guy kind of sound like... don't understand that I've got a right to be in Chris there. Tucker? <laughs> uh, why is he buying cans? So I'm buying cans because I buy them for 10. Break down the components and sell the components for 54. So I make 44 per one. It's it's a thing. Yeah. Where is that? Is that? Oh, sh oh, is it you? I need to. No. Oh, I didn't realize that was a door. Oh, hello, Sky. Hi, I'm Sky, and you must be. Valerie. Okay. Well, looks like this will be interesting. Is she real or not? So, B, you're dying. Um. Okay, that's a bit on the nose. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. All right. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. Asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. Ah. She was very insightful, isn't she? I was told this place would fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting, this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. We are here to understand. So what is it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died. Now move on already. Uh. That's tough. 
Rather let it eat away at me a bit more. Fear of death is what drives us all to do what we do. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. Just want the world to know I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? People I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction. The end. But as a change. That thought alone could save your life. I'm afraid of becoming someone else. Forgetting who I am. You're already becoming someone else. Every second of every day. Still, I feel a connection between who I was and who I'm turning into. What you really fear is becoming someone you don't recognize in the least. <sighs> so what now? You gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't. It's not like ASMR. I keep up with everything that's changing. You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it off. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, don't even feel like getting up. Few do, but everything has its end. Afterlife. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk. You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? Uh. Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? <laughs> Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. Do those lines on her mean that she's got a new... She looks just like a full robot? If you're yeah. done oh, here, uh, you should go. Ooh, you're good looking, it'd be a shame to lose that. Need your help, please. We should pay for info. I need this info. Name your price. Fuck you, your Eddies and that girl of yours. I could get fired for doing something like this. I'll make it worth your while. All right, fine. Now we're good. Hand it over and get out before you land me in the shit. First, tell me what you know about Evelyn. 
Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. You didn't have to pay? I know, but I feel like, like that I'm swimming in money right now. <laughs> more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. A customer attacked her? I guess. I don't know. Real mess that was. Security barged in, handled it. Things went silent. You don't go around asking questions here. Better off not seeing, not hearing. Keeping your head down. Who's Tom? A doll. Like the rest of us. What do you think? An XBD star? Where'll I find him? VIP area. Booth two, I think. Thanks. See? You turned out to be useful after all. Alright. Get inside the VIP area. God, I got to, got to make up those 900. <laughs> I still not, still not replenished. Hey, hey, hey. 